Hi everybody, so welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, hi, my name is Pamela and I make content on all different things including horticulture, hair, bags in my life, so if you're interested, don't forget to subscribe. I actually want to come on here and do an, a video on how to naturally age or whether you're terracotta pots, so if you're interested, keep on watching. <laughs> of an aged or whether a terracotta pot like this one as you can see this is a beautiful beautiful just terracotta pot that has been aged um, with the paint method more so than the natural aging one which is what I'm doing today so I'm just gonna put this one to the back but I love how you see the terracotta pot is aging and it's, it has this beautiful just uh, patina on it and you're wondering why is my plant pot you know my terracotta pot going white is this a fungus is this mold no why your uh, your terracotta pot patinas and ages is because of the minerals inside of your water so most of us um, we don't have like I'd say the luxury of using filtered water to water our plants so we use just faucet water tap water um, and inside of the that tap water there's you know you know certain contents or levels of salts and minerals in them and because terracottas are porous uh, it's a porous material those salts and minerals tend to basically get absorbed into the terracotta pot, terracotta pot and out of the terracotta pot so that is what this patina this aging this weathered situation that's what it is so again the reason that your terracotta pot goes from basically this nice brown you know love love lovely just you know burnt orange color to this more white covered frosted weathered look is because of the minerals from your tap water that gets absorbed into the terracotta pot so if you don't like this look use filtered water or use rainwater that has filtered water there's no chance of it being patina or aged looking but and rainwater the chance is very 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 low and it takes longer longer much longer to do that so if you're interested in how to get the patina uh keep on watching this video that's what i'm going to show you next okay guys so here's basically what i'm going to do first you're just going to get some soil and you'll fill your pot your terracotta pot specifically with soil so i'm just going to do that with this one I'm using the miracle grow organic soil so you just need just regular plain soil, nothing fancy, no need to do any mixtures of X, Y, and Z, just soil. And what I'm going to do for a month, about a month, um, is just water my terracotta pot with soil only. I'm not going to add a plant. And the reason I'm not adding a plant is because, keep in mind, your plants absorb the nutrients that comes from within the soil so you want the minerals and the nutrients to just be solely for your terracotta pot maybe you also use a saucer when you're doing this and not just do it on your bare counter so I'm just gonna actually repeat this with this planter pot I'm gonna put this pot away So now I have these two planters and I'm just going to water them again for about a month and you'll see a major difference. Your plant pot is going to go from nice and clean and pristine into a beautiful aged and weathered lovingly looking goddess. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video on how I'm able to naturally age and weather my terracotta pots so they can get this lovely and beautiful patina or this aged weathered effect that many of us love and you should learn to love too because your plants 
looks so much nicer inside of this than, you know, a regular old brand new terracotta pot. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked, if you enjoyed, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Share it if you enjoy. Subscribe if you haven't enjoyed this little cookie family. And yeah, let me know if you tried this method out or what are your methods of aging your terracotta pots. This method is one of two ways that I like to age my terracotta pots. In another video, I'll actually post on how I age it using paint. So keep an eye out for that. So yeah guys, thank you so much and I'll see you in the next one.